Yo, what's up, everybody? It is your boy Slim, aka Mr. Different, back with another video today. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to get a really good sounding talk box effect in any DAW using the effect um, Isotope's vocal synth, which is one of my favorite like vocal processing synth. I don't really use it a whole lot, but well, I have been using it a lot. But behind the scenes, you guys see me do a video with all playing around with it. But yeah, it's probably one of my favorite uh, synths for like robotic, weird, uh, distorted, auto tune, talk box, whatever kind of effect, computer effects. It's a really good synth where you can do a really good bit of stuff and like get some really unique sounds in it. And I'm going to show you guys what it can do and how to get a really good sound with it. And you can use it with any DAW too. So it is a paid plugin, unfortunately. So, you know, go check it out on ISO. It's very inexpensive, um, but it's highly, I highly recommend it. But I'm going to show you guys how to use it. So here it is right here. The vocal synth effect. It is a very dope effect. Um, so yeah, um, as you can see, uh, it comes with a lot of stuff. It comes with uh, a polyvox. It comes with a vocoder, uh, a, co a compuvox um, sound, and it has a talk box effect. We're gonna be focusing on the talk box effects. It also comes with some effects down here: distortion, filter, transform, shred, delay, I, and um, then you also got some pitch correction at the top as well. So it's a pretty powerful synth. Like you can do a lot of stuff with it. But like I said, I'll do a full breakdown of it. And if you want me to do a full breakdown of it, just leave it in the description below and I will go over this plugin in full detail so you can see how to do everything with inside of it. Just let me know in the description if you want to do that. So how are we get the top effect? So we're going to focus on two different modules. We're going to focus on the CompuVox uh, module and the TalkBox module. So we can go ahead and take off the PolyVox and the vocoder. And we just need to focus on the CompuVox and the TalkBox. That's where we're going to get the TalkBox fixed. Now I'm going to go ahead and set my um my uh, pitch correction to C sharp minor because I'm gonna sing in the C sharp minor because it's gonna sound really good for you guys because I can't sing so yeah um so I'm gonna switch over real quick to the sound so you can start hearing it through process through this so now. all right so now you should be hearing me coming through the actual um vocal scent as you can see i'm just putting the dry right now so first we're gonna start off with bringing the compuvox plug-in and we're gonna use mess with one parameter that's the bite the uh bits right here the bites bats or bites whatever it's called um we're gonna focus on that so we're gonna turn that all the way up to 100 and that's gonna give it like a really computerized like um noise effect so you'll hear when i bring it in so as you can hear just what it sounds like so like that old school computer stuff back in them old school days very scary so let's set that to 50 percent there we go so as you see it has a very like weird type of like um old school scary video game sound you know that that scary stuff back in the day sound so then we're going to turn on the top box effect and we're going to turn the top box all the way up so do keep that in mind um but i'm gonna go ahead and show you some parameters to mess with when you're doing this so we're gonna turn the the mode right here to bright because we want really bright and you're going to mess around with the speaker and the drive so uh as i turn the top box all the way up you are going to hear like you know you can hear the effect so here we go now you can hear you can hear the effect a little bit as you can see so yeah we're gonna change the we are gonna change the uh the oscillator to either um nice and easy is really good uh pipe dream is a good one i think i'm gonna use clip bites i think that's the one i was using before and it sounds really good so yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, it's a little bit out of tune, but it sounds like a tall but boom, boom. And right now, right now, I'm going to do da 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 So we're also going to mess with the drive a little bit. Give it just a little bit of drive, probably about 20 on a drive. And you can mess with the speaker right here you know get about 30. hear what that sound like it's what it sounds like we can also play with the format and get some pretty cool food. 
as you can hear, it's a really good effect. Let me hold on. As you can hear, it's a really good effect. I was I was still hearing it while I was while I switched over. But um now I'm gonna play with the transformer. Like add the transformer. I like to add the uh stir the sterling. That's a really good sounding one to me. Um you can add some delay to it. I'm gonna add a little reverb to it and um I'm actually gonna play the sound. So you can hear me sing through it and actually hear what it sounds like. But that's pretty much it. You just put 50% on the CompuVox all the way up on the top box. You choose your um, your sound or style you want. And I'm going to switch to the sound so you can kind of hear what they all sound like. And just play with the drive and the speaker a little bit till you get a sound you like. And I always turn mine to bright because that sounds really good. And like I said, I turn on the transformer because it just gives it a more focused sound. So um, I'm going to play around with some of the parameters. But that's pretty much it, how to get a top box fit. So let me just show just shut up and do some affecting real quick. As you can hear without the transformer. And a transformer in the sound really good. Sounds like a tall box. Sounds like a tall box. Computer love. Computer love. Computer love. Computer love. As you can hear. Computer love, California knows how to party. California knows how to party in the city. But there you guys go right there. A cool little way of getting a talk by sound using the Isotope vocal synth. Like I said, if you guys want me to do a full breakdown of this synthesizer, I will happily do that and, you know, play around with all the parameters so you can hear all the parameters in action and, you know, really get a sense of that. I said, I said if you really want them cool, robotic talk box vocoder or just a different sounding effects for your vocals, mixes, your hooks and all that, this is definitely the plugin to look into. Like I said, I highly recommend go copying it. It is very good and you will like it and it can do a lot of stuff, not just these robot fade outside pitch correction into it as well. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy. Like always, y'all know who it is. It is your boy Slim, AKA Mr. Different, not motivated by money, but like, comment, subscribe, and view them with everything say it. Leave me a comment, leave me a like, and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a good one, everybody.